said that rough weather is cause for dangerous situations on the road. This week, two ODOT, ODOT trucks have been involved in accidents just this week. Austin Love is live in Euclid with the details on this, including the new video of one of those accidents. And Austin, this is always a concern when they're out on the roads. Uh, it really is. You guys are going to want to stick around and watch this video. But yeah, as Matt's talking about uh, right now, we're seeing, the, as you're seeing right now, getting pelted by uh, some of this mist right now. That's going to turn into snow. Also, we're going to get those uh, high winds that we're seeing as well. So it's really going to be rough out there on the road for uh, at least today and for the next couple of days. So you're going to want to make sure that you're looking out for those ODOT snow plows because they are so important. Take a look at your screen right now. This is the video we received from ODOT. You're looking at I-90 near West 17th in Cleveland. A snow plow is parked on the side of the highway and then a driver who wasn't paying attention to the road clips the plow, skips, skids across the other uh, lane, and then winds up in the ditch. This also happened last night as well. Take a look at your screen. This is another example of distracted driving on the road and snow plows. This happened in Powding County earlier this morning when a driver attempted to pass a snow plow. That truck uh, ended up flipping as well. Now more ice, snow expected this week. Give those plows plenty of room to work and plenty of time to travel as well. Uh, uh, last year, snow plows were hit 26 times statewide. So make sure that when you see a plow, you move over and put down those distractions. But uh, live back here in Euclid this morning, as yes, we're talking about these high winds, we're talking about uh, th this gross mist that we're seeing as well. And you can take a look over here to my left, your right. Uh, this is some of the damage of what this wind has been doing. We're going to have more at 630, uh, including um, when potentially uh, we're going to see more power outages get fixed and some of that power coming back guys. Yeah, the visuals show it all for sure, but please don't be distracted on the roads as Austin said.